All right, let's have a look at our items. Uh, Tusk Helm. Helady. And when a property is used, this gains 20 damage. I mean, these are cheap, but I think we'll just take these two. Oh, never mind. Uh, buying and selling a weapon gives us 30 max health. I think we'll take that. And we'll pick up a small tool to start. When you sell this, give your weapons plus three damage. That's fine. Uh, here, we're going to go for Kyver Drone. I think Kyver Drone gives us items which can um, give us a good boost in power. Like this, for example, the Langzian. But what I am hoping for is um, Insect Wing, because Insect Wing is a strong... Um, early game item as well because it increases your cooldown okay, stacking these is going to really help our builds this is also strong too so any any of these items is good early so we fill this slot but having this would be good so that we can have an item to work with Okay, insect wing is fine. Let's put this in here. And small and large items might be okay to work with. Let's re-roll. See what we can get. Beast of Burden. When you buy another item, this gains 10 damage. I do like it. Beast of Burden is going to be strong for our build in the long run. I'll buy it to start. And that's how a master merchant makes a sale. We can we can keep it in here and just use this as our build for the time being. Uh regen's gonna make more sense. And then with this fight, I'll actually just put the beast of burden in here. We really need to get our economy going to build this item up though. Of damage early. Okay, if we can get one more trigger on these before Sandstorm, I think we should be able to win this fight. was very close the regen actually put in work in that build uh, in in that fight i mean uh weapon gold i'm gonna go to the jungle what's going on xp max health or income xp is good but Income's too hard to turn down, especially as pig. I can already see the XP or upgrade our weapon. Uh, game's lagging a little bit. I think we'll upgrade the base of burden. This being upgraded will make the damage on this um, much stronger. So let's upgrade this. So it gets 25 damage now each time. I want to get the XP, but the small items is better for this in the long run. Uh, 
I actually think we should just get the XP here. So, whose tea can I spill for you? Get a random item. Random item might be okay too. But I think we'll just take this. Okay, I'm gonna put this back into our fight. And we'll take on Tent City Mayor. How strong that's gonna be. Maybe we should take on coconut crab instead. I think we'll take on coconut crab because we're only level two. This deals a lot of damage. Okay, we do have more health. And we do have regen as well. So that's the thing that we have going for us. We get shield this um, deals 30 damage and we have scaling damage as well from this item as well so I think we should be fine for this fight oh that was too close though What's this one? When you fall me. below half health, shield equal to oh 20% of max health. This is good. Hard shell is nice. Um, we don't have any gold, so uh, I'm, I'm just going to get the weapon here. This weapon is fine for our build. And I think we'll just get the spare change. Trying to build our gold is going to be good. We don't have any properties. So that's a bit unfortunate. But regardless, I think the income is going to be more worth it here. And we'll take on this fight. We're probably going to lose this fight as well. This guy has some early damage. And he has a lot of heal from this. gives a lot of heal, this gives a lot of damage. It's four. So the scale from this is harder, but our items do hit harder at the moment. Okay, I think I think we lose this. Yeah. Damn. Let's get more weapons. If we see properties, I want to go for a property. But I think at this point, let's see what we can get. This one is nice. Regal Blade is strong. Every time you sell a weapon. These two pair really nicely together. Because this is every time you sell a weapon, you gain damage. This one's every time you buy something. So if we buy a lot of weapons, we can get a lot of health stacked up. I'll buy this for the time being, put this into our build, and then let's call it a day. Uh, get a heal item. It's going to be nice to get a little bit of heal. And we'll go for an easier fight. This guy also gives a lot of gold items as well. So having these two is going to be good for gold. So we have um, one, two, three, four, five out of seven. Five out of seven percent chance to get something that we can sell. Um, this is not great. This isn't great. So we can't sell this either. So this would be the worst outcome to get. Sorry, this would be the worst outcome to get as well. But yeah, ideally we'd want these two. Because this gives damage. Okay, that's nice. We got the gold. 
Uh, sells tools or gumballs. I'm gonna buy a tool. A bad craftsman blames his tool. A good one buys mine. Uh, when you heal at max health. Ooh, I think the cash register is gonna matter. A bucket saved my life once. <laughs> um, you just never know. Okay, we'll sell this. We should buy this and then sell it. This, these two items are good for a build, but the cook is so good though. It deals so much damage. But I, I don't want to. I don't want to go into this build because um, although Crook is a really strong item, uh, it, this is pretty meta at the moment. I want to try a different type of build. So we're going to avoid Crook, even though I know we could win with a Crook. Um, I want to try build into maybe, yeah, these two items. Let's try a large item. Start of each day, upgrade this. <sighs> this is a good gold item to buy. This is actually a strong gold item because um, each day it upgrades, and then when it's at diamond tier, you buy it for six, but then you can sell it for like 24. So, this is a, an investment in terms of an item. Um, this one, when you s this gains more heal. This one also gains value as well. But you buy this for 12 because it's silver. I actually think we should buy this. Let's see what else we can get. I'm gonna reroll. If we can, can we reroll? Oh, we don't have enough gold. Hang on. Sell this. Oh, we got an upgrade. And we got Pig's Gym too. I really want this. This costs 12. Okay, how do we do this? We have zero gold right now. We can sell four, five. We can even sell this, but I don't want to sell this. Because this is every time we buy a weapon, it upgrades. <coughs> so we have five, seven, eight, nine gold plus six. Your weapons gain damage equal to this item's value for the fight every five seconds. And when you buy uh, a weapon, it gains one value. So maybe we should sell this. So, okay. So then if we do sell it, we have um, <clears throat> 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So if we sell all of these, we could buy it. If we get rid of this... We could also buy it as well. When you buy a weapon. This is also when you sell a weapon. So these two pair really like well together. Um, <clears throat> this gains 50 there. And this pairs with max health. So I think these two pair really nicely together. Uh, okay, so our whole build that I think we want to go into is buying and selling weapons. So because this is not related to, it's related to item, it does take 10 seconds to trigger as well. I think we might sell this and buy this instead. 
and then we'll just have to get small weapons that we can use in our build. So let's sell, sell, uh, sell. Do we sell this or this? Sell this. We're going to be weak to our next fight, but it's going to be an investment that we're making. Okay, we're selling this. We're selling this. Um, if we sell this one, we can actually buy Pig's Gym and keep these two. Okay. So we're going to be weak for the fight, but... Um, in the long term, I think it's going to make more sense. Okay, uh, this gains value, or we gain income. We don't have 25 gold. I think it's better that this gains more value. So currently it's going to give 6 for the fight. If we move this over here... We're fighting pig. My dreams are too big for you to steal. <laughs> you do see these tusks, right? Okay, uh, is there any scaling in this? Okay, this gives scaling, so we will probably die this fight. Because um, the healing on these is going to be insane when um, the sandstorm kicks in. And also, the, he's getting much more shielding than we are, so we will probably lose this fight. I mean, we do have this though, 168 shield. Oh, okay, so the heart show actually saved us here because of the... Um, the shield amount so that means our whole strategy is to try and uh, basically keep getting more and more items so buy a weapon sell a weapon these are buy and sell a weapon you'll get max health okay so we're gonna try and go into shops and see if we can get more stuff So our whole strategy is just to get stuff. And yeah, basically our main damage combo is for this to give item scaling. Um, we can buy small items and small items will basically be beefed by the gym. So let's sell items. This gives spare change, so this is a nice weapon this is also a nice weapon too it's going to get reduced cooldown when we fight and this gives chocolate bars so let's buy this first Do you have to leave already? Uh, we're buying this we're selling this Cost eight. Mm. Don't think we want this. This is not a weapon. And we want weapon scaling. So let's reroll. This is a weapon. Oh, okay. Cash register is good. Uh, your weapons gain damage equal to its item's value. I'm going to buy this. Yeah, we're going to put this next to here. And we're going to upgrade our cash register. So our cash register still gives 3 gold. But the gold that it gives is upgraded. So... It's going to be better. Um, we can't buy this, so that's a bit of a shame. This would give good damage on these items because it does have um, medium status. Let's 
leaf. Okay, uh, we can't get the XP from this, which is a bit sad. We have no gold, so let's just get the... Actually, this gives 2 XP. The free... Let's go into here. We, we could get a, f a random item, or we can get 1 XP. I'm going to get the random item. I don't normally pick it, so... Now, does this count as buying it? I, th I don't think it does. Because if we get this... Oh, we, we so we do get the 30 health from this. That's fine. Um, okay. This guy gives tools, which we can actually use. So I'm going to go for this guy. going to knock some sense into you. The wrench or hammer is really good here. I would want to get the wrench though, because it, it just upgrades it each day. Oh, actually, this one's not bad too. Hey, what's one more scar? It's all about motivation. You gotta know. Okay, when you haste shield ten, that's for. fine. Um, health and regen skills, or chocolate bars, or sales weapons. I'm gonna get chocolate bars. Um, sell this. Uh, large items. We actually don't have enough to buy anything if we do go to this. So I'll go to the docks and earn some gold. Uh, we'll get a, a weapon. We got a cannon. Okay, I'm gonna get spare change. And then we're going to get three gold when we fight. So let's do that. Uh, yeah, at the start of the day, we get three gold and this gets upgraded. So This, which is giving a lot of shield and he's getting a lot of um, healing as well so I think we're gonna get defeated in this fight but our scaling is based on this item um, as well as the health that these items will give as well so this every time we buy a weapon we get 50 max health and also our regal blade gets scaled as well Alright, so sell a large item. Hello, little sentient. <laughs> okay, the, these are increased gold. And this sells for 24 now. Um, so I'll buy this because it's cheap. That is more. I hope I'm going to sell it. You. Reroll. Uh, nothing we can use. Ice cream chop is a really strong item, though. Okay, let's move on. We didn't get any items we want. Uh, this guy sells small and large items, so we're going to go into him. And any cheap items we can buy. So yo-yo is a good item to buy. Um, let's buy the yo-yo. 
Let's buy the brass knuckles, which sells for cheap. Oh, Lufus. Lupe is really good. Okay, I think here we're going to sell this now. So, the, this is our economy right here. And we can sell this uh, once it's upgraded. Um, and then we can buy another one and then upgrade that. Um, this one we can sell. Piggles. When you win a fight, get a piggle. Charge small items. Okay, this is another weapon. Sell that. I would get this, but I don't think... Um, mm, do we even want this in our build? Charge adjacent items. We would want to put this here. This is our only small item though, so... Okay, this we would move here as well. Uh, no. It's fine, we can keep that there. Okay, let's leave. This guy definitely gives gold, so I'm gonna go to him. Getting the shiny fang would be ideal because it's a two second cooldown um, which can trigger quite often. You'll win and you'll win. Shiny fang, but that's nice. <laughs> Get small items. You've just taken the first step toward good taste. Heal equal to your gold. Again, it's all weapon based, so let's reroll. This is a weapon. This is a weapon. I mean, <laughs> excellent choice. Sell these. 30 damage. Alright, let's get the XP here. Upgrade left my shield. Ah, oh, we had a shield item. Hmm. So we, we don't want to upgrade that. Uh, get an economy out. I think we'll get the economy. This one's fine because it's a weapon. And when we sell this, it's going to give us two gold that we can use. So we're stacking up our gold, saving it for something that we can um, buy. Okay, a lot of damage um, in this build. But we, we have quite a bit of health, so... We can survive quite a lot of um, damage. And we also have um, this, which gives 20% shield as well. So we, our items just need to trigger before this Next goes time, off, boys. and it did. Less blunder, more blunder. Uh, uh, no hard feelings, right? <laughs> okay, with this, we can actually go to the large item vendor now. Um, we can buy this again because it's uh, more gold for us. Maybe we should just sell this. I think this is going to be better than this. Yeah, it is. Let's sell that. Add that in. And this is multicast 2 now, which is nice. I don't know why it doesn't have multicast when it's by itself. For some reason, it has multicast 2. There. That's interesting. Okay. Does it have any tricks on it? No, it doesn't. It just says multicast 2. Um, but when it's by itself, it does nothing. Sell this. 
this is a weapon. Shipment will give us some items. So when you use a weapon, your weapons gain one damage. When you use a weapon, haste it. Jabalian drum is nice too. So when this triggers, it'll give it haste. Hmm. Okay, let's buy this. Sell it. Sells for six. But it is more health. It's 50 health each time. So I think we should always buy stuff like that. Okay. Uh, sells weapons. I mean, I would go for gold, but I think getting small weapons would actually make us money. So let's uh, continue that. These are weapons. They sell for four. Cash cannon is nice too. Each time we gain gold. Okay, I'm definitely buying this. Use it well. So we can Make sell it. it. I think six is a bit too much, but we will buy this and sell it for four. Multicasty, this gets triggered twice. Foreman or Infernal. I'm going to go for Foreman. Foreman has large items which we can sell. So these gold large items are nice. Um, this is a weapon. It's also good for our build too. Um, we don't have any shield items, but we can give more shield to one of our items. Um, this one is probably the most useless item, I think, for our build. So we want to get one of these two. Got the crane. <laughs> when you use an adjacent large item, this gains 30% uh, damage for the fight. If you use adjacent medium weapon, it gains. So putting this next to these two items, it's going to be really strong. I will sell it there because um, yeah I will sell it because our combo does more damage with this item as our damage ramps from this uh, this will be on like a one second cooldown and this will trigger every second as well so the, our combination items is we're trying to get low cooldown items. When this triggers, these items will be super beefed. Sells items. Let's go here. This is a weapon. Let's refresh. This is a weapon. And this is a weapon. Okay, sell these. We actually make money on the pepper spray. And this is also fully beefed now. We can actually sell this. So we have a lot of space now. Uh, property gains three value. Or oh, we could have kept it for this, but um, I think we'll just upgrade our leftmost weapon, which is going to be this. I don't think the yo-yo benefits very much from an upgrade so I think actually I think this getting upgraded would benefit more than this because the damage 
um, on this doesn't matter as long as this gets beefed. So let's just upgrade this one. Every time we sell a weapon, we're going to get more damage on this. So now it's 40. Let's see what we have here. Give your leftmost weapon 5 damage. I think that'll be this one. Let's give this 10 damage. Or maybe this one. Maybe we'll do the yo-yo. Give it 10 damage. So now it's 11. Like that. So yeah, we have fast triggers on these. And we're going to try to get cooldown reduction on our GM as well. I may be young for a captain, but I've seen my share of storms. Like my crew says okay. the bar. Our health is round. ramping up pretty high. I do want to get more upgrades on the gym though. Uh, Bizarcon is hard to turn down, so let's go for Bizarcon. Uh, we have a chance to get a, biz a diamond item, so let's try for the diamond item. Uh, it's a freeze potion. It's not that great. Let's get a skill unique to pig. You have one income for each property you own. Oh, damn. Let's sell these. Okay, this gives us more income for each property, but we, I don't think we're going to get more properties. This gets crit chance, which does benefit. When you use a property, your adjacent items gain uh, crit chance for the fight. This might actually be good. Let's get the crit chance. That means we want to position this item now in between stuff. So I think... Um, we want to put this at the end. No, we don't want it in there. We want it here at the end. Okay. I don't see myself using this, but I'm going to keep it. Um, thug is good because he gives... Let's just see what Thug gives. Okay, so Thug has some damage items, which um, he does give. Treasure Turtle is also nice as well. Yeah, th these two are good because they give um, decent items. I'm actually going to go for the Thug. Now, a good thing about Thug is he has a 10% chance of giving this item. Um, and this is a diamond item as well, so that's also quite nice. But um, even getting this, <clears throat> all these gold items, which give more gold, is also fine too. <clears throat> so yeah, Thug is always really good to get. But there's a chance to get this item, which is really powerful if you can get it. Okay, that's fine. We got this, which is an 8 second cooldown. It does um, give gold, so we can sell that. Sells health and regen. Uh, I'm going to work at the docks and get a weapon. More health. Uh, what is this? Upgrade leftmost weapon. gets gold for each property let's keep getting this upgrade because this is going to hit like a truck once we can get more weapons to buy and sell so this is giving 80 damage now and gumballs here is good too because gumballs can give um <clears throat> uh gumballs can give crit chance and and health and stuff like that so i'm gonna get gumballs 
let's sell this. Probably want to sell these, but I'm not going to do it right now. Let's move all of, uh, these up like this. That way we have space. Okay. So it's shield items. We don't have any shield items. So this is a bit of a waste. That's fine. But getting crit chance to all of our items is fine. Um, does this give crit chance if we... Okay, it does. Alright, so it doesn't need to be in our stash for it to get the crit chance. do this we want um this to trigger at least one so we can get more gold so i'm hoping the fight lasts more than eight seconds and and we would win too but this looks like it's gonna be a really strong um shield build the shield stacks really quickly from this We got quite a bit of gold from this item too. Okay, <laughs> gold. Um, sell small or medium. Let's get the upgrade on our cash register, meaning that we're going to get a lot of gold. Um, every time you visit a merchant, upgrade this. That's fine. Okay, so we want um, this to be here now. And we want to buy more weapons. This one. What about this one? When you win a fight with stained glass property, your properties gain full value. These aren't weapons, so we'll move on. Uh, this guy sells weapons. So we want to go here. Few warriors live to retire. Buy my weapons, and you might. When you sell an item, give this... Alright, we're going to buy this. Hey, you carry my weapon? We're going to buy you this. Let's sell... Sell, sell. We'll buy this. Sell it. This is probably out use its usefulness, but I'm actually going to sell this now. Um, okay, let's keep going. Oh, we got spare change. Hey, when you carry my weapon, <laughs> Use it well. Make me proud. Enjoy the thrill of battle. I'll look at Okay, uh, this guy has more cooldown reduction from this the uh, feather is going to be really strong um, otherwise keen eye will help us get more crit chance okay we got this instead which is fine Alright, so we're, we're trying to get larger items. 
Let's get large. These are not great. Uh, okay, this is something we can buy and sell. What should I do? And that's pretty much it. Get two income. Let's get more income. All right, let's go aerodrome. Let's re-roll. Sells items. Nope. We want weapons or large items. This buys for 24. Sells for 12. Is 12 gold worth it? <coughs> so right now, what we would get is 80 damage. We would get <coughs> one value on this and 20 max health. And we'd get 20 max health from this. Um, I don't think it's... Uh, okay, well, I'll buy it. So we have a lot of gold. If anything, this is getting more value too. So Sell this. Uh, probably has 25% crit. This is not that great. Okay, let's go into the next fight. We don't want this one. Uh, let's sub it out for this. And we have to remember before we go into the merchant, uh, we have three money slots for our spare change from this. Uh, but yeah, we have to remember before we go to the merchant, we should um, sub this back in the rewards card. Uh, you do see these tusks, right? Go ahead, underestimate me. It makes this more fun. Okay, this might be an infinite combo. Um, Ah, uh, it's not. It doesn't have enough damage either. Bring we have too much health. I've got another and luckily we got the crit chance on this one, so we ended that fight pretty quickly. Uh, uh, no hard feelings, right? Let's get more XP. Sells weapons. That's exactly what we want. And yeah, we're gonna sub this back in. Oh, these are expensive. Go make some more stories. Then come back and tell this one has... Oh, it's a deadly one. So this one would have crit chance on it. It doesn't say it, but I think the, the deadly tag, deadly Jabalian longbow, means that it has crit chance on it. It just doesn't specify. It's too expensive though. I'm not going to buy it. Um, this one we get some gold back for buying it, so... Enjoy the thrill of battle. Oh, you can. 26. I think the order to buy this is sell this first. Buy this. Hey, you carry my weapon? I fight alongside sell. Sell, sell. So we're back to 30. We could buy this, but I'm not going to. It's too expensive. Um, weapons platform should have something we could use. Let me have a look. Okay, so it has some haste items. Um, also has crit chance. Let me have a look at the Pharaoh's Khan. Okay, I, I don't think there's a, uh, anything from the first card that we can use. So... Let's go weapons platform. We do have a lot of max health to work with. So even if we um, this stacks really quickly, 
uh, we should be able to get some good damage in from um, this one. And we got a crit on this as well. 10%, 12% crit chance. It's all about motivation. You uh, when you use a large item, for. haste two small items. Oh, that's really cool. We'll get that. Upgrade leftmost weapon. We'll get an economy item. I think upgrading our weapon... If we were to upgrade something, it'd be this, but I don't think it needs up like these don't need upgrades. We just need upgrade on this one. So I'll get the economy item instead. Not great. Uh, let's get let's sell this. We don't need this either. Bronze tier junk. Or skills. I think at this point, maybe skills might be better. So let's get more skills. One income per property, shield, 15. 15% crit or more max health. I'm going to get more crit chance. Uh, and we're going to buy gumballs. Gumballs will um, make us gold. So let's move these up. So each time we buy a gumball, we sell for one. So we, we don't lose any value by um, selling gumballs. And this is also giving us a lot of crit chance as well. So we're already at 5% crit chance. When this triggers, it's going to yeah give us 15% crit for the fight when it uses this. So I, I think what this means is when it uses again, it gives another 15. So if this can trigger twice, it's gonna give 30% um, crit chance. Okay, let's uh, pop these in. We're at day nine. So if we lose, we should still be able to survive. Boring. A lot of burn on the, um, this guy's build. died okay we just need to get way more health then uh, increases your offensive okay, let's get more items getting more value so um actually if we buy this i think we only lose one gold on it yeah so this gains more value so it's a net profit like it's net neutral um to, to buy it uh we could get xp and level up i'm actually gonna go to aerodrome because i think we can get some decent events we want to upgrade pig's gym so i'm gonna try and go for large and we got it Oh, we should have traded this item as well. Um, yeah, we should have subbed out this item too. That's probably why we also lost that fight. Um, <clears throat> okay, I'm going to re-roll because we can't use anything here. We got upgrade for Pig's Gym. So now every time we upgrade, we get 50 max health.
Okay, uh, Awaken District. Are we strong enough to take on Awaken District? It's a 7,000 health. Uh, does a lot of shielding. Uh, I don't think we're strong enough. Can, can we take on Property Baron? Let me have a look. Property Baron has 3,000 health. Okay, we should be strong enough to take on Property Baron, so I'm going to fight Property Baron. Okay, 1,000 damage is okay, but when this triggers, it's probably going to proc a... Um, there we go. We got a crit. Upgrade leftmost. We're gonna upgrade Pig's Gym. There we go. So we're gonna upgrade its 100 max health each time we buy a weapon. We should go to the merchant, but I'm actually going to get more XP here. Uh, this guy's a merchant. So we have to do so these get more value um, so that's why I'm keeping this before we um, sell it we don't have any shield well, you're doing your part to clean up the bazaar it's 5.8 this is four this is six. Okay, this, this is net. We actually make money off these, so. Um, this has multicast too, which will trigger our, um, our yo-yo multiple times. So I'm actually tempted to just uh, get more damage on the yo-yo instead. That's been sitting there oh, 20 uh, years. Try and get more crit chance on this, actually. Trash is tragedy. Reuse everything. Okay, now we sell this. And get, um, this one. Oh, this is a weapon, actually, so we should buy that. Which gives, makes everything more valuable. Uh, we should buy one more item. Well, you're doing your part. Sell this. The then sell this. Um, we don't have any haste, so I don't think Trash it's going to matter. Tragedy. Reuse everything. Okay, let's keep going. Uh, we need to sub this out. I need something to to cover this. Are you sure? Noticed? I'm huge. You should know. I'm a bit of a legend on Pelago. Okay, this is a turbo poison build, but we have um, almost 3,000 uh, crit with this. Defeat does yeah. not defeat me. So, <laughs> this is a trivial fight. Oh, don't let this get you down. Eyes on the track. Okay, Bizarre Con. 
although this might be good, I actually think just going for weapons is, is the best thing that we can do at this point. So let's uh, sell all of these. Use it well. Buy, Make me proud. buy these. I prefer action. Uh, this is expensive. Go make some more stories. Come back and so we're only going to do that one. I think these are too expensive for us. Get a weapon. Get chocolate, get bars. Heal item might be nice at this stage of the fight, but... We don't know what heal item we're going to get, so I'm actually just going to get a weapon. The weapon's going to be beneficial in terms of giving us damage, health and all that. So we'll take the weapon. And we've got a cash can, which also sells for quite a lot of gold too. Let's sell that. Get economic items or fight a monster. I think we're going to fight a monster. Economic items might be nice, but uh, fight gives us XP. And we have this almost upgraded as well. Stop resisting. Okay, this fight should be fine. Get a 3.1 second come around on this. Disregard intel. Target threat level. I've come too far to okay. let you uh, stop me. More gold. Lord Arkin. I think we should be able to take on Lord Arkin. I don't know if we should do this. seconds this is this is actually stronger so we'll keep that in there but we do need something to cover this let's take on Lord Arkin hopefully we can fight this and uh, level up but yeah um, we should be pretty strong against this okay yeah luckily we got that crit Oh, and we got this too. Large weapon. Ah, actually, we have no large weapons. Never mind. Um, gain more income. This gains three value. I think maybe the three value might be okay. Uh, yeah, let's get more value on this. Get a freeze item, enchant with poison, or sells medium. I think um, these aren't worth it. Let's get the medium. We have a chance to get items. Um, like weapons like this. At the start of each hour, this gains two value. Okay, let's go for Sell these. This is going to sell for a lot of gold. <laughs> These two are weapons. Gumball machine. Okay. We we can buy these ones. Oh, the these aren't worth free. too much. I like the exercise. Okay. Let's get small items. This this would give us three, but I think it's probably better we just get small items. You're a smart one. This is better than that. Remember, diamonds come in small boxes. This is a weapon. Okay, let's sell. Oh, hang on with this. When you heal, gain damage. No. Heal equals double your gold. Okay, I think we'll put that in there. 
Whoever said money can't buy class had neither. This is a weapon. Tell everyone you got it here. Which we can sell. Okay, so now this is fully upgraded. Each time we go to a merchant, it sells. We can sell these for um, a decent chunk of gold. But we won't sell it right now. My dreams are too big for you to steal. <laughs> oh damn, this is gonna be insane. I think this is gonna stack up damage really fast. Luckily not as fast as I thought it was going to be. I think the XP is going to make more sense. Get a weapon. Let's get a weapon. Weapon gives us damage on this. Oh, there's a large property. Uh, we're swapping this out again. Getting more value on this. Okay, let's sell this. This is already gold right now, so let's get more XP. Um, okay, Void Colossus destroys an item. Has 6,000 health. I think we should be able to win this fight. Because this actually takes uh, 10 seconds to trigger. Okay, there we go. You seem like a nice person. Maybe too nice. Okay, let's Get an economy item, get spare change. The five spare change is a lot of gold. But we actually don't have enough space for it, that's the thing. Um, I'll just pick up the economy item. This is fully upgraded. Sell that. Let's take on the rare event. Trade health for power. We have. Oh. Lose 20% of max health, but then this gets 50% crit. I actually think getting crit on this is the right choice. This would have 65% crit, and we have um, a lot of damage on it. We could also get this just for more damage. I'm going to do it. Um, we can easily get 2,000 health back. So let's do it. Let's get the crit chance. Uh, we're going to get gold tier items now. Okay, this is a weapon. Do we get anything for just buying stuff? I don't think we do. Let's buy this. Sell. Uh, so right now this has 95 damage on it. Shipment is really nice. This item's cooldown is reduced by 5% for each adjacent large item. 
Uh, okay, let's buy shipment. We're gonna sell the shipment. I thought we would get some weapons, but we didn't. But buying that for like 12 um, means we can still make our money back as well. Let's leave and let's sub in this so we get the heal every five seconds. It's not much, but it is it is something that will contribute to the fight. Boring. And if we can get this to trigger one time, it should kill the stuff. So... These only destroy small items. Oh. This is small or medium. Wow, that was a strong build. Okay, we lost that one. We can go enchantment. I, I actually don't think we benefit that much from an enchantment. The only thing that would matter would be haste. So let's let's actually do it. Let's, uh, oh, we got poison, damn. Okay, I'll get poison on this item. So it's two poison, which is really bad. Um, risk some coin. Let's go here. Uh, get 600 or XP. I'm gonna get more XP. Got three XP. Sells items or skills. Let's buy a skill. Crit. When you gain gold, gain max health equal to double the amount of gold. I'm actually going to do this one because we have items that we're stacking up. Oh, we have lifesteal as well. I feel like this getting lifesteal is going to be good because when this gets... Um, damage it's going to give us life steal and this is going to be on a one second cooldown if we can get it so i'm actually going to give this life steal so it says 29 it looks like a low number but it's actually not we should sell these okay so we have um this giving us max health that's fine we'll get uh the Frost Street Challenger because our level is really high. So we should be able to get some of these items. If we can get this item, that would be awesome. Otherwise, um, Blizzard is also good too. I've come too far to let you stop me. When you sell this, your freeze item gets more freeze. Sell that. So I actually think we can sell all of these now, um, get double the gold, but I'm not going to do that right now. I'm going to get a skill. And we should have actually put this here before. Okay, let's get cash deposit. This will give more damage on our items. I actually think we should just go sells non-weapon. Um, use a property. This one is good. Let's buy this. This will actually make us gold, I think. Okay. Oh, we got XP from this as well. 2 XP. So we got to level up. Um... Reroll. When you sell this, when you sell a small item, you gain max health. Don't really want to sell these right now.
let's leave. Okay, so now we got the XP. This item gets more. Or should we just get... Do we have any friend items? We don't have any friend, so we can't buy this because it's not going to be useful for us. Uh, we can get a weapon. And I think getting a weapon is probably the best thing because we want um, more damage and health. Okay. So we sell this. We put this in. We don't have many fights left. I'm actually going to sell this item. We should sell this too. But I'm actually going to keep it for the time being. Three gold each time we visit a merchant. No, okay. We, we're going to sell it so we can have more health. And we're going to keep this one around because it, it does buff our damage. So let's do that. Okay, we just want this to trigger at least one or two times. There we go. We got the crit off on this. to get max health. I'm actually going to go here instead. Getting the items makes more sense. Okay, these two are relatively cheap, so we'll sell all these. Um, this should have been here. You see that, Barker? That's how it's done. <laughs> Not what I call tasteful. Okay. Bizarcon. Let's go Bizarcon. Um. Get three small items. Or XP. Let's go XP. And we'll fight Awaken District. So I'm actually going to put this back in. If we can get this, that would be good. It's all about motivation. You uh, that's fine. We didn't get it. Uh, get a weapon or get chocolate bars and gumballs. I think five chocolate bars and gumballs is better. Although, this gives us damage on this. Um... Currently we have 64% crit. We get 30 from this and 100 from this. So 130 health from this. Um, or there's a chance we get crit chance and stuff. I'm gonna get the weapon. Let's start of each fight. Uh, oh, if we have Dragon Tooth in the fight we can get damage. Okay, let's do that. Add that in. So it's extra damage. Spend three gold. Yeah, okay, let's do that. Temp boost for more max health. Get bronze tier items. You see landfill? Oh, we got XP as well. There's a weapon. 
This is also a weapon. Your shield item gains three shield. We don't have any shield items, sadly. Do we have any slows? No, we don't. Okay, these are some damage items we can use. Warms my rusty circuits to see that final. So weapon. While you're doing your part to clean up the bazaar. Hat's been sitting there 20 years, waiting for you. The trash is tragedy. Reuse everything. Leftmost. That's this one. Let's get more damage on this. Sell. 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 We don't really care about this. Okay. Leftmost gets more damage. Economy. Get loot items. If you have a friend, do we don't have any friend items. All right, I'm gonna get loot items. We've got regen and we got poison. Okay, we didn't get a chance to use this. I think the gold is gonna matter more. So now let's sell all of these items, and this will also buff our damage too if we sell everything because uh, it is the last fight so it doesn't matter what we have now so we'll just sell everything okay so we're at 300 now we have um, decent healing with these um, and basically we want to just try and one shot with this item and we have 16,000 health how much health this Vanessa has. 6,000. Okay. So if we get one hit from this, it should be a kill. Next time, boys. Less blunder, more plunder. So that was a decent poison build the Vanessa had. Okay, so just a quick breakdown of our build. Our whole build was built around Pig's Gym and Arms Dealer. So these two, um, each time we buy and sell a weapon, we get 30 health. So yeah, when we buy it, we get 100 from this and 30 from this. And then when we sell it, we get uh, 30 max health. So 160 max health just from buying and selling a weapon. We also get 80 damage each time. So we, we're able to stack this to like 4,000. And also we had items like um, our skills like cash deposit. So at the end we had 300 plus gold. Um, so that added to our damage. We also had um, when you gain gold, you gain max health. And we also had this one. When you use a property, adjacent items gain 15% crit chance. Uh, so we were able to stack crit chance on this item really quickly. Um, so when this item triggers, it basically gives this another 15%. If it triggers again, it'll give another 15%. So we can get this to 100% crit in um, around nine seconds, uh, sorry, 10 seconds. Um, so getting the crit on this one will allow it to double the damage of the hit. So if this is doing 4,000 per hit, it's gonna do like six, uh, 8,000. Um, the other items that really helped was this one. When you use a large item, haste small items for two seconds. Getting these um, add to our damage. This one's for survivability because the um, Adelardo had lifesteal and the ointment had heal on it as well. So pretty much this whole build is around stacking health and damage uh, based on how much gold we are able to get. And so, yeah, buying, selling items. The economy was really important for this build so we can try and buy and sell items as 
fast as possible to try and stack damage on um, on this item, which is the main source of our damage. Um, and we had these smaller triggers here, which just provide more damage. If I was to kind of do this build again, we might not even care about these items here. Uh, we might just care more about defense and just stack damage on this. But yeah, that was pretty much our build.